Hello, my name is David Callahan, and I've been asked by the course team to make a very brief screencast showing you how to create a journal entry. It's very straightforward, so let's go through it. So to create a journal entry, click on the link to the journal area from the course. Now in here, I think it's in module content, and then go down to week one. At the bottom of week one is a link to the personal journals. Click on personal journal. The next thing to do is click on the button that says create journal entry. It does not like a button, but if you click it, it will allow you to create a journal entry. And here's where you begin to start typing up your thoughts. So my first thoughts okay, on what a story is. Just got some text in the paste buffer to paste in there. If the course team don't tell you what sort of length they're expecting, and a couple of paragraphs should be okay. Anything over 500 words might be a bit excessive. Uh, and if you keep it brief, it's more likely that the course team will read it and make some more informed comments about that. So, uh, there are some things to consider when doing this. First of all, please follow the instructions on the content from your course team. If you haven't yet been given a suggested length of post, a couple of paragraphs will be all right. Journals are private between you and your tutors. Even so, please be mindful of netting, and i.e. don't identify individuals, stroke organisations, don't make negative comments without backing them up, etc. And lastly, entries that meet an excellent criteria are, with your permission, likely to be published on the course team's external website. Something you should strive for, but perhaps not in the first posting. So, once we've typed our words in here, we might want to tidy that up a bit, scroll down to the bottom, and then click Post Entry. And that's it. Is your entry done? You uh, might want to um, comment on your own entry. Say, for example, your thinking's moved on a bit in a few, uh, after a few days. You might make a comment and reflect the comment on it. When the course team makes comments, I'll show you where some course when the course teams commented earlier on. So there's a comment here on his first post, and that we did just as a test. So have a look on what the course team said about that. Sorry, clicked the wrong thing. Let's click on comments. And Arthur said it was great. Thank you. If you've got any questions uh, about the technicalities of doing that, then please give me a, an email on david.callahan at edgehill.ac.uk. I'll be very pleased to hear from you. Thank you.